Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm so glad you could join me today. I'm so excited. I have a very nice unboxing for you today. I'm going to be opening up Dee Dee's Deluxe Bead Box for the month of June and I'm super, super excited because I have loved every single one of their boxes. I've been doing unboxings for them for quite a while now and I've never been disappointed. Now, if you're not familiar with Dee Dee's Deluxe Bead Box, I'll leave a link down below so you can go check it out. Dee Dee's Beads is a small family owned business out of Canada and they have an online store. I've been on it several times and I love every Everything they have to offer. They also have a Facebook group and I've heard that they have some great sales on that Facebook group. They focus on designer inspired created themes and they usually include trendy hard to find beads. Another thing that's important to know is that it's not considered a value box okay so you're going to get some high quality beads and components. Also their boxes are limited edition releases on a first come first serve basis so once it's gone it's gone guys okay. It goes for $29.99 plus shipping and they ship within Canada and the US only. So if you live in Canada guys you'll obviously get the best shipping rates okay. Now if you live in the US your shipping shouldn't be too bad. But anyway they have a reveal day on their Facebook group on the 15th of each month so if you want to get the notifications for that please join their Facebook VIB group so you can learn about their monthly new releases before it gets sold out. So anyway guys do go to their website check it out check out all their products they have wonderful pricing I'll leave a coupon code along with their website address down in the description section of this video the coupon code is Louisa 15 and it'll give you 15% of your first order towards 90% of the website listings there are some things that you can't use it for and one of them is the deluxe bead box but I'm sure you'll find plenty of other things that you can use it towards. Now before we get started let me remind you that if you haven't subscribed please think about doing so because it really does help my channel and it helps me as a content creator to stay motivated to create more videos for you. And if you do subscribe, please don't forget to hit the notification bell so you can be notified every time I release a video. Another thing that helps my channel is if you give me a thumbs up and leave a comment down below. I read every single one of your comments even though I may not always get to respond to them. So anyway guys, I'm very anxious to see what's in June's box and the sooner I do the unboxing, the sooner I can sit down and design something with the beads. So let's go ahead, turn the camera around and we'll get started. And here we have Diddy's Deluxe Bead Box for the month of June. And I absolutely love this message. It says, inspiring your creative senses. It's such a nice message. Let's go ahead and open up the box. And it always comes wrapped so nicely with tissue. I love that. Let's take a look. And let's take a look at this insert. As you can see, it's the June 2022 edition. The theme of the box is Tranquil Moments and it reads, need to escape, sit back, close your eyes and breathe in deeply. Imagine yourself surrounded by nature's paradise with cascading waterfalls and towering mountains. Balance your mind in the sanctuary of peace and tranquility with cool tones of aqua greens, natural wood and a lotus that symbolizes strength and resilience towards the hustle and bustle of everyday life. I love that. I love that message. It's very timely, especially in today's environment with all the things that are happening with inflation and everything. So I really appreciate these kinds of messages. I'll take whatever message of peace and tranquility that I can these days. I'm sure you feel the same way as well. But anyway, guys, down here it shows the materials. And I love that they list the approximate pieces per strand. So not only do they list the length of the strands, they also tell you how many beads are in each strand approximately. And as you can see, there are quite a few items here and it looks like we get a bonus as well. Down here it says, I hope this month's edition has inspired you. Happy beading, Stella. And here's her email address and her website address and her Facebook group address. So anyway, guys, let's take a look at these lovely beads. And already I'm loving these colors. Let me go ahead and pull them out and we'll go through each one. As you can see, the colors are very bright and cheerful and very summery looking. Let's take a look at the strands first. As you can see, we have four gorgeous strands in these beautiful blues and greens. Let's take a look at this first one here. These are gorgeous frosted glass beads, as you can see. They're eight millimeters in size and the color is azure blue. And this is a seven and a half inch strand and we get approximately 25 beads. And this blue is so beautiful, guys. It reminds me of the ocean. It reminds me of a lake, a waterfall, anything aquatic. And it definitely looks very summery. One of the nice things about frosted beads is that they're a little bit translucent. So the light shines through them. But the texture is so pretty because they kind of absorb the light. They don't reflect it. 
and it really gives an interesting effect. They look great when you team them up with something sparkly like these beads down here. I love mixing up my finishes. I love having the frosted look along with sparkly or shiny beads. And the 8mm size is very easy to work with. They look great by themselves and they also look great in beaded components. So I don't know how I'm going to use these but I know I'm going to definitely be using these. Let's take a look at this one now. This color really caught my eye. I love these gorgeous rondelles. As you can see they're faceted. They're 8 by 6 millimeters in dimension and what's so neat about these is that they actually have two tones of green. The color is succulent green but if you look closely you can actually see some yellowish green but you can also see some bluish greens. They're so interesting and even though the description says they're matte they actually look a little bit shimmery I would say or they have some kind of a luster on them. But anyway guys these are gorgeous and very eye-catching for sure. So I know I'm definitely going to be using these and don't they look great with the blues? I love them. Let's take a look at this one now. This is a very interesting shape. The description says they're twisted, opaque, sky blue, check glass beads. They're 15 by 9 millimeters in dimension and this is a 6 inch strand and we get 10 beads as you can see. And what a pretty shade of blue this is. They're absolutely correct when they say sky blue. This is definitely a sky blue color. A lot of times bead supply companies will list the color sky blue but when you look at the actual color of the beads um, it's not really a sky blue but I would say this is definitely a sky blue color and the shape is very very interesting but I think what I love about these beads is that they're translucent and that means they're going to look great outside in the sunlight. I can totally see using these in anything whether it's a necklace, a bracelet or a pair of earrings. So anyway I really love these, they're gorgeous. Let's take a look at this one now. These are listed as triangle faceted crystals. The color is mystic blue and it's a very long strand. It's 10 inches long and they measure 7 by 5 millimeters in dimension. You get approximately 40 beads in this strand. But what I like about these guys is the sparkle. Look at this gorgeous sparkle. Oh my gosh, these are so beautiful. You can definitely see blues and greens but you can also see other colors in there. I can see purple, I can see pink and I can even see gold. But anyway guys as you can see these definitely go really well with the blues and the greens so I'm going to be using these for sure and again I'm not sure how I'm going to use them. I don't know if I make a necklace, a bracelet but I'm definitely going to be using them. I love all these strands and I love the palette. It's beautiful. Let's go ahead and take a look at the rest of the contents. Look how interesting these are. We have wooden beads, we have ceramic beads and this is actually the bonus item. This is a resin component. Let's take a look at this one. Of course it has the beautiful blues and greens which will match perfectly with the blue and green beads. It measures 25 by 22 millimeters in dimension and it's actually one-sided so on this side we have a marble effect and on the back is like an aqua color. So that's very interesting. I like that. The other color that I see in the resin component is this beautiful yellowish color. So these are definitely going to coordinate with this component. Let's take a look at them. These are listed as handcrafted ochre yellow olive shape ceramic beads. Now it does say that the shape, size and color may vary and I think what they mean by that is that not all the beads are going to look the same so there are some slight variations between one bead and the other and that's fine. I love that look. But anyway guys these are 14 millimeters in dimension and I'm not sure if that's the length or the width. It doesn't say in the description. I think that's actually the length. They look about 10 millimeters across. But isn't that cool guys that we get some handcrafted beads? I think that is so cool. I love that. I love to be able to tell my clients or my friends that the beads are handcrafted. I think that's a very appealing feature to know that a jewelry piece has beads that are handcrafted. So anyway guys as you can see we only get six of them so I'm going to have to use these wisely. And let's take a look at these wooden beads. These are so pretty. These are polished olive wood lantern beads and they measure 15 millimeters in dimension. As you can see the holes are pretty big so if you wanted to use these on leather you could. So that's another idea. I could use some leather with these beads. I'm not sure yet what I'm going to do with them but I am getting all kinds of inspiration and these are absolutely gorgeous and because of the color they actually look really nice with these beads. And I love that we have these different elements. We have the ceramic, the wood, the resin, the crystal, the glass. Let's go ahead and take a look at the metals now. And here we have the metals. As you can see we have a lotus theme which goes along with the whole idea of balancing your mind and the sanctuary of peace and tranquility. We have some melon spacer beads. We have a couple of lotus connectors. We have a lotus pendant as well and we have these beautiful silver wavy disc spacers. 
and here are the melon spaces and of course I accidentally dropped one but I'm sure I'll find it later on but anyway we're supposed to get 25 pieces you're only going to see 24 in this dish but as you can see they're in a silver tone and they measure four millimeters in dimension and the holes are actually pretty large so I'm pretty sure that you could probably fit these on leather cord that's at least one millimeter thick but I'm not going to know until I actually try it because I've had beads before that look like they have uh, large enough holes and then for some reason when you try to put leather cord through them it doesn't fit but these are definitely going to fit on beading wire or craft wire for sure so I'm very happy that they gave us spacer beads and let me go ahead and put these on my dish as well as you can see they're definitely wavy disc spacers and they're in a silver color just like the rest of the metals and they measure eight millimeters across and we get 25 pieces these actually look very nice stacked so let me go ahead and put them on a rod and show you so here they are on my rod and by the way guys these are called magic rods I use these a lot to arrange my bead patterns if you're not familiar with this product I do carry it on my Etsy store and if you've been following my channel you've probably seen me use these rods in my tutorials but anyway guys I thought I would show you what these spaces look like threaded on so here they are stacked and here I put them up against these ceramic beads and they look really nice like that as well and I thought I would thread on the melon beads as well so you can see what they look like threaded on as well so anyway it's a lot of fun to play with these and you can use them in all kinds of ways more than likely I'm going to be using them like this I prefer this look better than having them stacked plus we don't get a lot of them so I don't want to waste them by stacking them in groups like this so anyway this gives you some idea of how you can use them and then we have these gorgeous lotus connectors aren't these pretty they're actually very good quality you can tell because they're nice and heavy each one has two loops as you can see and they're two-sided so that's nice you could definitely make a pair of earrings with these but I think I'm going to be using them in a necklace more than likely I'm not sure yet I'm going to have to think about it but I love them and they go really nicely with this pendant as well now this pendant is a little different so it has texture on one side and it's smooth on the other side I'm assuming this is probably the front and I think it should probably be used this way so the flower is upright but because of the open design you could actually hang something from these bottom petals so anyway guys it's very very pretty I love it here's the full collection I absolutely adore these colors I love the shapes the sizes the beautiful textures I like all the different materials I like that they gave us ceramic wood resin and of course the crystals and glass are gorgeous I'm happy that they gave us silver metals as well because I think it goes really nicely with these colors I have all kinds of ideas flowing through my brain right now by the way guys if you're based in the US and you're thinking about buying this box keep in mind that the pricing on the website is in Canadian dollars so you're going to have to do the conversion the cost in US dollars is actually less I would give you the amount based on today's conversion rate but it changes every day so I don't want to do that but if you go to Google and put in the Canadian dollar to US dollar conversion you should be able to get results based on the current exchange rate so anyway I hope you enjoyed this unboxing I sure did let me go ahead and put these beads away and I'll come back and say goodbye I'm absolutely mesmerized with the June box don't you love those beads I have all kinds of ideas going through my head and I can't wait to sit down and design something so please come back and check my channel because I'll be publishing a tutorial very very soon and if you have any recommendations about what I should make please leave them down below in the comment section I really appreciate it thank you so much for watching I'm looking forward to seeing you again have a great day and I'll see you next time. Bye.